this video, I'm going to demonstrate how the notification center has been combined into the home screen in iOS 11 on an iPhone and how this interacts with the widget view. Now it does look different than the iPad, which is why I'm making it a separate video. So to start off, I'm going to send myself a test message. You'll notice that the message appears right there. When you try and swipe left and right, like you would on iOS 10 to interact with the notification, you'll notice that the notification does not interact the same way on iOS 11. But when I tap into the notification, I get the messages widget. I get the same type of dark keyboard which appears on the iPads where I can reply, I can go to my apps, but going to other things requires you to enter your password. So I'll cancel that for now. And you'll notice that the notification has disappeared. When I unlock the device by using Touch ID, I slide right up into the home screen. When I slide down for Notification Center, the home screen reappears. When I slide left, I still get the same widget view that I would get on iOS 10. When I click Edit, I'm able to add some widgets. So I'll add Plain Paste, I'll add Music, I'll add Siri App Suggestions, I'll add Stocks, I'll add Tips, and then I'll tap Done. And you can see that it loads in a similar way that it did on iOS 10. Now there is a new feature and that is a rotatable widget view. In past versions of iOS on at least the smaller iPhones, you could rotate in other apps and you could see a larger widget view. However, in iOS 11, all you have to do is simply rotate the device and you get a landscape widget view. Here is what the landscape widget view looks like with the clock off to the side and underneath the clock the day. When you scroll all the way to the bottom, you can edit it. It still only has one column, which is an important thing to note. When you tap Done, you can go back to the widget view. It's not scrollable from the right side. It appears to only be scrollable from the left side at this point. This concludes the tour of the combined home screen and notification center on iOS 11 running on iPhones.